welcome back to the vlog. Happy 2023. It's hard to believe I'm saying 2023, but time is just flying by. I hope all of you had a wonderful and safe New Year's. I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. I haven't talked to you guys in a while. Um, I'm working on getting my breakfast pulled together, so we're going to do that together. Um... Yeah, and just talk about some things. Um, so today is not going to be too crazy. Um, number one, we're going to do breakfast. Number two, I have to run to Whole Foods. Um, number three, I have to do something I dread. All these braids, it's time to come down. And that's going to be a chore. So that's going to be my work for the day. Um, let's see. I also want to talk about how this past week went. Um, I, um, I'll do a separate video maybe tomorrow about wrapping up all of last year. But yeah, we're going to talk about the week and all of that. And so let's get right on into it. Um, do I have my plate? Uh, Yes, 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 I have my plate. Okay, right here I have a piece of turkey sausage. So, you know, let me position you guys a little bit differently because you won't be able to see it. And I'm trying not to make so much noise in the camera. But hold on a second. Alrighty, so here we are. So right here is my vegetable mix. Like here, I said already is my um, turkey sausage. On the stove, I have... A piece of the California Country Girl cinnamon bread cooking. Um, I'm toasting it um, and then cast iron skillet. So we're gonna just get some of these vegetables here and um, okay let's do this and we're gonna have our bread we're gonna have our coffee okay that yeah that should be enough that piece right there Let's close this up. I do have my coffee already together. Let me run over here and turn my toast over. Okay, here's the coffee. This is a caramel flavored coffee. Um, I didn't put my sweetener in it yet. Hold on. I guess I should have been a little bit more together, huh? Okay, there's my sweetener. And, um, like I said, it's the caramel flavored coffee. Some Skinny Girl. I think I told you guys a while back, I did order the Skinny Girl Naturals. Um, that does not have the, um, that funky sugar in it. Um, the Splenda, so I have some of that, but I gotta get through all the other stuff instead of throwing it out. I need to warm this up, and by then, um, our toast will be together. So hold on one second. All right, here it is. Our meal is pulled together. This is what it's looking like. This is the cinnamon bread. This is a very good bread. Um, California Country Girl has wonderful products. Very, very clean if that's what you're looking for. It's not cheap, just like the Unbun. It's super clean, not cheap, but really good. So that's something to think about. And my coffee. We are going to eat this and get our day moving along. So I will check in in a few minutes. Okay, Daryl's gonna are passing by, but we'll check in in a few minutes. All right, guys, we are back from Whole Foods. So let me just show you what we picked up. It's not a lot, so this will be really quick. I wanted to get um, two of these butters. This is the Green Valley um, lactose-free butter. I have two of them. I don't have any more peanut butter, and I don't eat it that often, but when I do, I like to get the really good peanut butter. So this is Santa Cruz. In my opinion, this is the best you can buy. Um, 
Let's look at this. The ingredients is organic um, roasted peanuts and salt. That is it. Gluten free. Um, per serving, which is two tablespoons, is carbs is six grams and the fiber is three, so you're three per serving, which is really good. And this is very clean. I had ran out of a bone broth, so um, I got some more chicken bone broth right here, and I have some coconut chicken bone broth to do a, like a coconut um, turmeric chicken soup or something like that. So this one is going to be for soup. Now this one, because the taste is so very mild, um, I had it in my head, I would use this to make my hot cereal with. So we'll see what it tastes like. But the taste is so mild, I'm thinking it, it's gonna be fine. So that's my idea. Okay, that's that. I got some baby carrots, because carrots don't bother me at all. Um, I ran out of coconut aminos, so I picked up um, another container of it. I like my power greens, super greens, or whatever. I was looking for the protein greens, but they seem to have been out. Seem like for the last three weeks they've been out of the protein greens. They're similar to this, um, and I mixed the two. So I got these, and can you believe it? We had not one egg in the house, not one. So I got um, this um, 18 pack of eggs. So, and that's basically what we went to the store for so guys i'm going to get back to doing what i need to do and um i'll check in in a little while all right guys i am back i'm sorry for this weird glare but um so we were going to talk about how the week went um, I haven't given you an update since I've been back home, um, from my little getaway for Christmas. I did a video shortly after I got there about the shenanigans that happened. So to get everyone caught up to speed, um, we drove down to California to be with our relatives. Um, so driving down, there was some unfortunate events okay um weather wise and vehicle wise so we got as far as oregon before we were hit with a um ice storm and that was hellacious it it was scary and it was it was bad um there were semis turned over in ditches cars and ditches and people stranded. It, it was really, really bad. And I thought um, from looking at the weather map, we were going to escape it. It was more contained to Washington State, Seattle, but no, it, it was really, really bad. Um, we kept going, get almost to the end, um, and we're hit with what I would describe as London fog. Couldn't see a thing. It was bad. Um, almost get to our destination in the car, the truck breaks down. And, you know, it's just, it, well, the good part is, you know, it was less than $1,000. So we're grateful for that. But we did enjoy, and coming back home was very uneventful, thank God. Um, so my week last week was it was okay. It was me kind of getting back, getting into the groove, cooking, getting stuff together, getting myself, you know, ready because tomorrow is a work day. So I, I cook a little bit today to be ready for um, tomorrow. Um, let's see. I have already prepared some um, curry vegetable soup, which I can just put any meat of my choice in. Um, and... I do have some vegetarian meat options because, you know, I a while back I talked about this. I'm doing probably like one vegetarian option a day. 
Um, but the week was, it was okay. It was, you know, we got back. It wasn't anything too crazy. Um, you know, had to unpack and, um, do laundry, just, you know, the regular little stuff. So it wasn't a whole lot going on and it was not like a, a super lot for me to report. Um, I stayed on task. Um, I was able to drop while I was gone 1.5 pounds and, you know, it was good. I, I had fun. Um, I was keto probably, I want to say 98% of the time. So it was good. It was really good. Um, what I plan to do the rest of the day, um, so I have my food ready, is when I get ready to eat, I show you my meals. Um, and I might even, hmm, actually pull together my meals and just have them sit in the refrigerator for, the only day I worry about going to work is Wednesdays, because Wednesdays is my early day, and I have to be there, I mean, well, I don't have to. I get there by choice at work about 5.30 um, or a little before to avoid traffic because where I live and to my main office, it's quite the drive and the traffic is horrendous. It's horrendous. So I have to get there pretty early in the morning. So I might pack my lunch for that day um, to be ready. Um, the other days, I don't really have to worry about it too much. But... That's, yeah, that's basically how my week went and the update from, you know, the week prior with um, my Christmas vacation. And I was able to get a cute picture. My daughter sent such a beautiful picture of my little grandbaby. She's just so adorable and I love her so much. So, um, yeah, that's about it. I don't have too much more, but... I'll be checking in again a little bit later um, so we can see what I'm having for dinner since I have a few options. Oh, and I think I smell dinner, at least the meat part of it. Um, the wife is downstairs cooking filet mignon. That's a treat for us. Those, those suckers are expensive. That's something else I was going to talk about. Um... If you're doing any type of diet or keto, low carb, whatever, I hear a lot of people say how expensive it is to do it. It's not that expensive if you're not trying to do all those keto treats. If you cut all that out and just stick to the basics, it's not that expensive. Yes, you want the best quality you can get. And if you just, your finances are just not there, do what you can with what you have and cut out the keto treats, and you will be fine. Because um, I hear a lot of people say, oh, it's so expensive, it's so expensive. And it's not expensive. It's not expensive. I have a keto room, and I can tell you now, I went way overboard. I have a whole room full of keto stuff that's old, and I haven't even opened, and it needs to go in the garbage. It's a waste of money, people. It is. Take it from me. The person who's probably spent thousands of dollars. It's not worth it. Stick to the basics. Your body will love you for it. Every now and then, a treat. Every so often, a treat. And every so often doesn't mean it has to be every day or every week. It could be every two weeks. So you don't need to spend all this money doing all this crazy stuff when keto is and low carb is such a simple, simple way to eat and you can tailor your macros according to what it is you're trying to achieve if you're trying to gain muscle if you're trying to lose weight if you want to maintain it's very flexible and, and it's not that expensive so i will be back more than likely you're going to see my soup i made a really good um, curry vegetable soup and I'm probably going to have some filet mignon with it. So we'll see. Um, I'll be back in a little while. Alrighty, I am back. Oh, this bowl is hot. So here is my 
Let's see if you can see this. Dinner. So this is my curry vegetable soup. It has um, power greens, some carrots, and of course the cur curry, um, coconut curry. And I just cut up my um, filet mignon and put it in here. This is going to be fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to be eating this. Um, I don't have my water bottle. I left it at my daughter's house. But I will be back out there and I'll remember to get it. So I have this cup here. And this is my second refill. And that gets me the same amount. So I'm almost done with that. And um, yeah. I am going to call it good here and eat so I can get this video up for you guys because I don't want it to be too long. Um, but I hope you've had a wonderful day and your new year is starting off fantastic. And I will be back a little bit later.